Brussels has slapped down Emmanuel Macron for his repeated threats in a row over fishing rights, telling him to cool the temperature. France has warned it is ready to cut off the UK's energy supply if it does not grant more fishing licenses to small boats. The comments made by Europe Minister Clement Bone on Tuesday were a significant escalation in the post-Brexit row. Lord Frost said the rhetoric coming from Paris is not really a fair reflection of the efforts we have made. For all the frustrations of the last 18 months, I can't think that we as a country have resorted to those sorts of threats, he said. We've not made those sort of direct threats to our neighbours. The vaccine export ban earlier this year is another example of where the EU resorts to these sorts of threats quite quickly, and that's not how we should behave, we don't, and I don't see why our neighbours feel they have to. Unimpressed by the way Paris is behaving over the dispute, the EU appeared to side with Lord Frost. Dot. An EU diplomat told Express.co.uk it was time to dial down the rhetoric. They said it was important any frictions were settled via the proper procedures laid out in the trade agreement. The source said, we need to cool the temperature of the water. We need to sit down and talk amicably, it's very warm water at the moment and that doesn't help anyone. Another said, we need to sort these problems out so we can then move forward and work together on the many important global issues we both face. Under the terms of the UK-EU trade deal a new partnership council was formed, with politicians from both sides sitting on the panel. The partnership council is the formal way problems in the implementation in the trade deal can be addressed. European Commission Vice President Maro Sefcovic heads up the EU team on the Council, while the UK is represented by Lord Frost. Yesterday the Brexit Minister said, we have granted 98% of the license applications from EU boats to fish in our waters according to the different criteria in the Trade and Cooperation Agreement. So, we do not accept that we are not abiding by that agreement. Queen Margaret II to bring Karen Blixen's image creating worlds to life in Netflix film.